dude that way that was the longest setup time of my whole live stream time ever since february i started trying to live stream after noon eastern time it is oh it feels like it was longer than it was it's 1309 that feels like it was a long time hang on let me turn the sound on feels like it was a long time yes we got to talk in the middle hannah Mori. i did everything to set up and then um i kind of push off updates on my stuff so i did the update which took like all that time which there is no time so it didn't really take a lot of time because you guys don't even realize i was trying to live stream or was it you guys calling me in because i swear i can feel people thinking about me i can feel people thinking about me let's see where we're at i feel humans here <gasps> that way humans that's a weird word that's a weird word i can't believe i called you guys humans i'm sorry Hey, Alex G. Hannah Mori. Hi, Derek. Degas. Dude, Melissa. I was thinking about you. Not surprised you're here fast, fast. Was thinking about you. I'm even speaking British for you. Thank you, Melissa. Alex G., don't worry. We'll be talking about a half an hour. We'll see. We'll see what happens. It's sunny and warm here, but the children are all at school, so I'm just kind of hanging out. Oh, dudes. Oh, my gosh. So many people at the same time. I love it. Yeah, anticipation that way. Yeah. You know what, though? You say that. Uh, I like that you put that there that way. 1309 Eastern Time. Anticipation. Yes, because it makes me realize that I want to do it as well. And that feeling of, like... It's cool. Hey, your friendly Generation X Degenerate Capricorn. How are you? Anna Mori, there was haha. -ha, we were in another live. Oh, night up, night right on. Yes, Melissa, you're in my thoughts every day too. I think I hear a four-wheeler. I don't know why. You're in my thoughts every day. Uh, Lucy, too. Lucy, too. Big time. Hey, Morgan and Reed. Hi, everyone. I have to log in for physical therapy in five minutes, but I wanted to pop in and send love. Dude, really quick then. Morgan, I'm going to pull you, if it's not too fast, five minutes. That was 11 11 or I mean 1 11 boom Eastern time when you said it so I have just time to pull you a card Morgan Morgan and read oh you're gonna change your screen name right on Jen you're due it is uh, equinox after all shed a little skin shorten that up or long it up a little bit whichever whichever Make it something I can pronounce, though. Oh, double, sweetie. I'm Reed. Morgan, anyone who feels this is for them? Double cards. Ooh. I went cross-eyed there. If I'm going to read what it is in French, but I think that's self-evident. Nouveau partenaire. New partnership relations I know go figure double cards one saying new partnerships and one saying relations one with the like whoop and the other one she's already on it what do you like that eh not gonna go into that any farther whoever that resonates for jab that up your little butt and fucking rotate it and like Pass into action mode. Go for it. Boop, boop. Universe is pushing you anyway, isn't it? I know that's why I pulled it double. I know. Thanks for having me pull that really fast, Morgan. Yeah, can you feel it? 
I love you too, sweetie. I wish you the best physical therapy stuff ever. Rawr, it's gonna be awesome. Look for this blue color and the green, but I'm resonating more with the blue right now. I don't know, I think that's pretty hot. You know what I mean? And I think that's pretty hot right there because I'm looking at that and it matches. It matches the card that I've got still beside me from the other night. I can't get rid of my waterfall queen here. I don't know why, but it that seems to just like flow into each other, eh? Thank you, sweetie. That was cool. One more time, right? That's just too good to be true. Oh, I love it. How are you doing, Angie? Thanks for being here. Being, being like a jelly bean. Awesome, just in time. Enjoy your day, Morgan. Thanks for popping in. That's what you get for a pop-in. Whoop, whoop. <laughs> Ooh, hey, Sandor. How you doing? Honestly, Alex, I know you as Alex first, but Sandor is what I think when I think of you. Does that make sense? So Alex pops up maybe as the avatar, the, the profile thing. But when I think of you, I think Sandor. Hi, Cindy B. You found us. Yeah, I started streaming 7 minutes and 21, 22. I like the 22 better. 22 seconds ago. So you're just like in the like beginning of time. I pulled double cards already. Look at them. They kind of match together, hey? What are the chances of pulling double cards and then they both be like this? Ooh, me like them. Oh, and the blue matches the truck almost. It pulls on purple, but hey, I can't help it. You gotta bring the truck energy into that. Oh yeah. I know, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna do it. It's like, it's Tuesday. Go wild. It's toes day. I'm going to jeep that. Much. Wah, wah. Okay, I'm done. I know. I don't really wear belt buckles, but I have a belt buckle. I know. Wah. Cindy B, I was in the chat, but my phone must have got hung up somewhere else. I don't know. Hmm. I don't know. Hi, Trixie. How you doing, Amber? Whoa. Double cards again. Oh my gosh, you guys ready for this? Bow, bow, bow. Oh, the bee's upside down. Maybe I'm pulling double cards because we're the 22nd. Double twos. And maybe I'm pulling double cards because we're like the 2-2. Two, 2-2. Two, 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 gateway day. Me not know. Maybe there's double fours because double twos makes double four. And hey, might as well pull the seven in today. Sweet results await. I swear. Cindy, that's beautiful. Thank you. I love you, sweetie. 13, 17, maybe I just needed to do restart it like I did because I was getting worried about you. Thank you. Sweet results await, and they do. And my little, um, my little ramble purge type of just throw out there exactly how I feel um, has brought back already a lot of sweet results. Um, and really fast um i woke up this morning in complete security abundance wise um not in excess but enough to be completely just like 
like, shh, that part's like, suck your right now. And um, that was important for me. I demanded that yesterday and I got it today. And I have no words really to express the state of grace that I feel about that because just um, just that in itself was, was a lot. And um, I can't say that other things are accelerating fast, but the guidance within is really to just um, know, like the 44, the 144, just un understand that everything can't be shown to me at once so sandor she's glowing yeah i am glowing i am glowing really a lot right now um to wake up and to feel more secure right away gone to bed um in a way of like just pushing through the fight or flight that wants to come in allowing the feeling of what it is that wants to pass through like not denying it but not entering states of panic or, or fight or flight. It's, it's been a special 24 hours. It's been a special 24 hours, I tell you. Um, there's, um, I don't know black and the, just the tone of gold and green of this and the true colors the true colors that shine through is it's so huge right now and um it doesn't matter what i'm faced with um i have had times what i've noticed is that what my myself asks of me is to more just the acceptance it's big and the faster I accept and allow and the vulnerability um, brings the sweet results. They don't just await, they are appearing. I'm going to read those after I catch up with the chat. Thank you, Melissa. Yeah, I think I put the lights on, to be honest, because I usually don't use the lights. I think I put the lights on so that it, not even to accentuate it, just even to show it or hide it in a way I, I can't even explain it like my hair is moving I don't know if you can see it but and, and maybe it's not it just feels like it yeah which moon love the cappy energy big time there's a lot of cappy energy in here right now right now I tell you the cappies came in like full force really quick eh yes Rosie Jenner is a Capricorn too thanks for bringing Rosie into the chat and I say chat, the stream, whatever you guys call it. Whatever you want to call it. Let's bring Rosie in. Rosie Jenner. Big time thinking of Rosie. I say that. It's more of a connection, eh, Melissa? It's not thinking. It's connected. But you know what I mean. Thank you, Cindy. Yeah, there's an alignment that comes into with the with the asking and the listening because a lot of stuff I'm being told I'm not so fond about and I'm like that re re reintegrating or re-tipping the scales for myself. That's it. Um I can't explain, but it's just that's it. Trixie 22 is your number. Right on. Thank you that way. 1320, you said that. We are all the 12 signs of the zodiac. If you are Capricorn, it is only your game piece. You must master all 12 signs and become the 13th warrior. Yeah, I don't resonate with the Capricorn thing, but I will identify with it to pull in the, the resonance of that. You know that. Hi, Jan Sue. How you doing? Oh, 
I'm not sure if you meant Melissa where you said she needs a hug. If you if you meant she is me, yeah, definitely. Big time. Big time. I have no idea what a real hug feels like in a certain way. I'm not saying that in a mean way, just I know what I mean. Frequency doesn't lie. Yeah, Jen, your first born is 22nd. My second born is a 22nd. This is 22. My first born is a 7. Your first born is a 1. Right on. Jan Sue, you need a hug too. Sending you super hugs, sweetie. Big dragonfly hugs. Big, big dragonfly hugs. Yeah, 1221 is a symbol for change. Hi, angelfish. Well, he's doing okay, Melissa. How's Louie doing? How is Louie? Yeah, Trixie, there's also the conjunction of Saturn and Jupiter on December 21st. Send in hugs towards Jan Sue. Thank you guys. That's a lot of hugging going around. Cindy, I'm obsessed with planting potatoes. Oh, sweetie, we'd go good together. I'm obsessed with eating potatoes. You plant them, I'll eat them. Woo! DK, Cindy B, my taters didn't do so well. Do they taste good, D? Like, maybe they're small and look funny, but do they taste good? Just wondering. Because when potatoes taste like all sandy and stuff, it, yeah. Like, even if they're clean, like, when they taste like not so yummy but when they're really small and they're delicious then like that's magical it's just like good things come in small packages sometimes this one time i grew cantaloupe and i only ever got one cantaloupe and it was this big like, it was not really big it was like softball it was like a softball size cantaloupe but it was the best cantaloupe i ever had but i only got one You have one female weed plant right on okay let's start with the b because b is the seven right love potatoes too jansu me too potatoes is just like it's important i need potatoes personally potatoes are a grounding for me grounding 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 Anamori, they're the meat of my Irish peoples. I don't know. I love um, potatoes and I've lived off them often. So <laughs> I must be part Irish somehow, somewhere, in some time and dimension, right? Seven, B spirit, sweet results await. The B spirit's message is that sweet rewards are on their way if you're willing to let go of your to get your ego out of the way and immerse yourself in the connected energy of all things. That's exactly what happened to me yesterday, by the way. It's pretty much well more well worded than what I just probably rambled on about, but that's pretty much what happened. Get the ego out of the way and immerse yourself in the connected energy of all beings, things and beings, believe me. Be spirit knows not to let a sense of being a separate self get in the way of a good thing. Spirit is always producing honey. Miracles and magic are everywhere. Yes. When you connect with the great hive. Not in a manipulative way. When you connect with the great hive, you are vibrating and buzzing in exquisite, exquisite harmony with all. B spirit asks you to focus, that your focus be on connectivity. I need to slow down. 
trying to read too fast. Like, what am I on some sort of like train or something? <sighs> Slow down. Your body, heart, soul, and psyche experience total interconnectedness and a true integration when you self forget. When you remember that you are part of a greater unified consciousness. Moving from separation into connection, from self-centered limitation to self to spirit-centered infinite possibility and potential, you become busy as a bee, enjoying the gifts of bee spirit. Fully in alignment with your highest expression of yourself, your heart opens and creativity rushes through you seemingly without effort as you experience that, as you experience that nothing feels like work important nothing feels like work industriousness is driven by enthusiasm and inner motivation and time seems to fly by quickly as the hive supports you in the making of honey do you feel the presence of your helpers in the hidden realms adding their energy to your creations magical results are taking form and will be sweeter than you expect i swear if i get told that one more time i'm gonna Bee Spirit wants you to remember that your, ta your part in the divine partnership with the conscious universe is being rewarded even if you can't see that yet. And ask that you share your good fortune as there is plenty of honey for all. Be a part of the larger whole, the force that brings forth all that is sweet and delightful. I'm going to go back to the potato talk. Oh my gosh. I think I saw potato and leek soup down there. I would eat that. Trixie, I don't know about food. I can't chew right now. Well, we'll make potato soup. Exactly. That's why the soup was there. In my heart, I'm cuddly with y'all. Like when we're coming around a fire with tater soup and warm bread. Oh, yummy. That sounds awesome, Angie. Yeah, Cindy, I find myself thinking about potatoes and they do bring me comfort. Same. I feel bad for potatoes to be called a couch potato in a mean way. So if I'm going to call somebody a couch potato, it's so loving because I love potatoes just that much. Right? Yeah. Don't use it in a mean way. <laughs> Which moon? We was told one at one time potatoes are bad. I know everything's been good or bad, right? So at some point you gotta just, oh, that was you DK's the potato and leek soup. Yeah, leeks are awesome. <laughs> Cindy B, I planted three weed plants this year and apparently they were all male. <laughs> well, right on, good to look at, not smokable right? I don't know. Oh, well, they're pretty, right? Ooh, Jansu. Oh, no, Trixie, but you really don't have to chew mashed potatoes. Oh, yum. Now I want mashed potatoes. You know what? This is going to happen, right? It's going to be a potato type afternoon. It's 1332 and I got potatoes on the brain. Yeah, with green onions on top for sure. Really, 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 really thin. Yeah, Alex. See, Alex seconds that masculine energy, Cindy, with the muscle and everything. That way, funny that I've lived off potatoes. Oh, I think a lot of people have. Give me potatoes, salt, and butter, and really pepper, you know, but just those four things and I'm good because I can find water, right? So do I have to add the water? I don't know, but yeah. Mm-hmm. 
Since I heard potatoes are genetically modified and have come from something like a yam, I could be wrong. I don't care where they come from. Seriously. I don't care. They're so good. That's it. <coughs> yeah, and there's yummy potatoes and really yucky ones too, right? Just like anything else. Thank you, Cindy B. Hi, Nova Nova. How you doing? How's your day? D case, I'm glad we're still talking about potatoes, he says down there. You know what? I love when we do live streams and then like go off on food. Why? Because it syncs us even more together. It does. You're not going to see a potato now for like a hell of a long time and not think of everybody's like little potato comment and like the you know what I mean so it's like um it weaves us together with the just the buds yeah Cindy B I don't know if you're talking about the marijuana plants the buds or you mean like just the buds of like blooming like things that link us together it's fun When I remember when we talked about tomatoes, not potatoes, I don't know. I think there was like three to five little knockoff, um, like ripple effect videos uploaded with tomato sandwiches or tomato in the gardens. Actually, it was probably a little bit more like 10 or more. But if you go into all the garden plus, you know what I mean? So... Melissa says, I made bubble and squeak last night. I have no idea what that means, sweetie. Is that a UK thing? Potatoes and cabbage. Is that what bubble and squeak is? I love cabbage too. <laughs> yeah, that way. So many ways to have a potato. For sure. Bubble gump those potatoes. Nova Nova, I'm doing good. I've been playing a fun game called Among Us. I feel like playing Pac-Man for some reason. I don't know why. Just yesterday. Oh, why? Because somebody talked about playing something yesterday, and then I said, I feel like playing Pac-Man. Let's bring up another, like, 80s thing while we're at it, right? Pac-Man. Cindy B, I'm ready for potato soup as I've made so much and I've eaten so much tomato soup, but I love tomatoes. Mmm, yeah, tomatoes on toast and tomato soup for sure. What's the sink, Nova says? Uh, just because we're talking about potatoes, so anybody's going to put up potato stuff, so then next time you see potato things, you're going to think of potato people comments from here. So, like, we're, like, making the sink or the sink of, like, when mashed potato comes up and like somebody starts to drool, that feeling. Hey, Corey Reeves. We're talking about potatoes. Do you like potatoes? What's your favorite kind of potato? Medley. You know that game? Anna Marie, right on. Trixie, Jansu, my son plays that in a Twitch stream with his friends. Oh, cool. Twitch streams are awesome. Richmond73, I love Pac-Man. You have that game? Oh, okay. I come play. I'll be there as fast as I can. Cindy B. Yeah, I love all the weaving that links us together. I do enjoy it throughout my day. I think it's fun and it's nice and it it's it it, cr it creates something that is realer than what can be around us. So, you know, we don't know what somebody's going through in their day. So, if you're faced with a reality around you that like just is overwhelming in the moment, but you look up and you see like this color blue and a truck happen to pass by. 
<laughs> I don't know. That just all of a sudden is like, whoop, of like, and it's like a magical reality check of, yeah, no, this is good. Let people do what they need to do and just focus on the blue. It's all good. It's all good. And it's the little things that sometimes just look up and feel that thing or that person or that energy that just to put back on track of just breathe. Just breathe, right? We got this. It doesn't matter. Hey, Shimmy Shiba. <laughs> nice one. Where you are in the world. <laughs> I love that new sub thing. How you doing, Shimmy? Oh, now I got Shimmy Shimmy Coco Pop, Shimmy Shimmy Rock. Isn't that in uh, Stand By Me? I think it is, eh? I see the words, I say stand by me as I see Corey's name pop up. Jan Sue saying hi, Corey, and stand by me, and Corey, um, Yieldman. Yup, think, think, think for me. Ooh, you're in Chicago, right on. That's so cool. Well, thanks for being here. Thanks for Chicago, right on. That means that you're near... Freya Warrior Princess. I believe she's in Chicago. If not, it starts with a C. It's not Cincinnati. WKRP in Oh, I love that you write that, Jensu. Trixie, our sons could play together. My son is 10 years old. Lily Rose is 8. How old is Louie, uh, Melissa? <clears throat> is he 10 or 11? I forget how old Louie is, Melissa. I'm sorry. Uh, 10 or 11. Corey Reeves, born in... Pocatello, Idaho. Oh, yummy. That's awesome. I remember when I, um, JW, JW, Justin, Justin, Justin with an O, O, Justin, JW, um, when we, because we, we met through comments in both of our videos and stuff like that, but then we, we, came in, in in a chat through uh Jen's gems and stuff so but <laughs> I remember saying like that thing of like potatoes and of course he had the restaurant so that linked us on the food train really fast with our sinks and just our our life path me and JW Idaho thoughts and perceptions out loud I swear I was invisible the other day yeah it happens I was stand, standing by the wall and people walking past me like I wasn't even there. I even tried to speak to someone and they totally ignored me. No, baby girl, they didn't ignore you. They just didn't see you. Get used to it. It can be even more radical than that. And, uh, yeah. That's it. It's real. So, look for the people, just like anything, like in Coco, right? Some people don't see you. You look for the people who see you. Don't even look for the people who see you. Just attract them to you. And if none come to you, then that's just those days where you're doing all the stuff and your background player in your reality. That's so you make your stuff around you. Call your synchronicities to you. Um, bring forth the songs, the stuff. Ask like for more syncs to feel okay. So like. The worldly people don't see me right now. I'm invisible. Bring me some sinks to make me feel real. Like, am I even where I'm supposed to be if nobody sees me right now? And sometimes it's like, yeah, yeah, you're big time where you're supposed to be, Melissa. And just, you know, that's just it. Invisibility is really a part of the thing. 
frequency doesn't lie. So you can't be in other people's frequency and they can't be in yours. And that is really real and it's becoming more and more self-evident, right? That's why people are being torn away from a job. It's, it's like, yes, you had all the warnings for, you know, a week, a year, a day, all this time all this time but it the tearing away is fast because you can't be people can't be in certain frequencies together the separation is real it's very real <clears throat> and you can only be in certain frequencies and like try or, or or do certain things you can't go against it anymore things just 1344 on the 22nd eastern time and batteries at 43 you can't you can't push it anymore it's just everything's so accelerated that just yucky stuff happens everywhere if you're in a frequency that doesn't match um to be very light filled even if you're subtly and not like preachy about it just how your energy is will trigger other people's insecurities to the point of them changing their habits in any given moment and depending on how aware of, of self you are and other people, you know, why certain things are happening. Um, you know, it, it's really going fast, eh, Melissa? Which man? That's my mom, Betsy's favorite movie. I haven't watched it since she died, but I thought about it. Um, I usually watch Stand By Me at least three times a year. I haven't watched it since 2019, the spring 2019, um, when I left, uh, the lakefront. Exactly, Melissa. Thanks for saying that. Yeah, I'm like that too. Maybe not for that type of thing, because I am not into the festival thing, but I totally get it. Thoughts and perceptions out loud, Melissa. Back in the 90s when I used to go to music festivals, I would literally walk through the gates. I believed wholeheartedly I was invisible, and I never got stopped. Yeah, and that all, yeah, and, and it's real. And it's, or it, 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 it's real, Melissa. Thanks for validating that, you know, that you were doing it even before, because we were. Whatever you believe is what you're going to get, right? So. Trixie, I'm going to lurk for a bit. I need to get busy. Okay, sweetie. Thank you. <laughs> Shimmy Shim. Shiba says, same, Trixie. You're going to lurk a little bit and be busy? Okay, I get it. Thanks for saying you're here. That's awesome. Melissa, I just finished the series American Gods. Cool. Is it good? I'm not sure what that is. Trixie, your son is 12. Right on. Just perfect. Arr. That way, Wednesday or Thursday, starting a new gig, painting a brand new weed dispensary. Interesting. Interesting for sure. 1342 shimmy is there a tarot card reading about to happen i don't really do it that way sweetie it just kind of like stuff comes out like right now i had pulled this and i was halfway i had read this one and kind of went into it so at some point i might re-pick up the book and finish this one not quite sure I'm trying to just make sure I'm caught up with the comments before I go off on another thing at this point. And I'm already five minutes, six minutes behind. I think, yeah, Trixie is on Instagram. Or is it because I have her on Discord? I don't know. All the freaking apps. Oh, I'm having a hair issue. Hmm. Thoughts and perceptions out loud. Alex, I had some mad stories I wanted to tell you guys, but I truly do have a fear of the camera. Huh. Do you have, um, does doing audio bother you, Melissa? 
like if you just read into your note you know we all have on no matter what device on phones and stuff there's always the um, audio thing like to just say the stuff and then to upload something with it to write it we'll figure it out Melissa I love it when you're in front of the camera. Are you still here, Shimmy? I'm gonna pull you a card. I can't, I'm trying to catch up with the comments to see if you're still there, but. This one's gonna be for Shimmy. You are still here? Okay. Yeah, my live streams are a bit different. I kinda don't try to keep up with the chat if I, if I do keep up with the chat too much, I have nothing to go on because I'm not coming in like necessarily for myself in like any promotive type of way or or doing things. Uh, whatever flows for us all is what I come in for. And that's a little bit different, but um, in the way that whatever's meant to flow through will flow through, meaning that it doesn't matter, you know, who comes in or what. If the cards are meant to be pulled, even the tribe is going to be saying, I don't know how many comments. I just pulled double cards again, dudes. Um, those of you who are here often enough know it's not something that's very common for me. But Shimmy, these are yours, sweetie. And anyone else, obviously everything that resonates. Wow, the one. These are beautiful. Oh my gosh. I don't mean to cover up the number. The one and the 25, two and five is seven. I'm gonna read them like now. I'm not gonna like, hey green, that's so beautiful. So that any messages that need to come out. You guys realize I'm gonna be a lot behind of uh, the comments. I'm just gonna check and see if there's anything that's not. Okay, I'm just going in. I'm not sure if agarine is the way to say it, but that's how I'm going to say it. Integrity, solidarity, impeccability, reliability, consistency. Although we are always evolving, we all possess deeply held values that we do not have to compromise. Your personal integrity matters. So if you're feeling pressure to say yes when your heart says no or to be something you're not, listen to the message Agarine Spirit brings to you. Now is the time to remember the importance of being reliable and impeccable with your word. If you really wanted to, say no. Don't say yes for now and try to connect your mistake later. People may struggle to accept your truth and your decisions, but stick to them. Be solid and consistent because what matters to you deep down matters to the conscious universe who loves you. If you are feeling unsure, doubting whether you have a right to take a stand, 
become still and reconnect with the conscious universe through this crystal. It's not your job to protect everyone's feelings and keep the peace at all costs. You don't have to rush about smoothing everything over. Be at peace as you stand firm for your deepest values are in sync with your purpose and the conscious universe wants you to feel and be strong right now. Yeah, all double doubles, eh, Hannah Mori? Yeah, do you think I'm saying it right? Agarine? I don't know, eh? Elf herself, spot on for me at these moments. Oh, baby girl, me too. So spot on. And I, it's, it's, the cards are falling out double today, Elf herself, seriously. Um, it's, it's a two, two, two portal day and my cards are flipping out double, sweetie. Al, are you here? Heading to Colorado? I'm bouncing in and out so everywhere in the chat right now. Um, but I don't want to miss if anybody comes in and, and out really fast, right? I'm going to reshow the double cards from the beginning relations and partnerships these two fell out at the same time connect whoever wasn't here it's 12 13 55 on the 22nd that flip of the 55 and the 22 like right now these were the second double cards with the numbers 7 and 44 And these are the third double cards. Love light shining, I see you there. I'm glad you're here. I'm gonna read this. I just finished reading that. Green Adventurine. Number seven, number seven. And the five and two, I just said it. Wow, I didn't realize that. The five and five and the two and two, flip them. And I got the five and the two in my hand right there too. Yup, yup, yup. Thanks for, um, thanks for being here, Shimmy. He inspired some awesome cards to fall out. I think they're very needed on a very um, thank you. I'm gonna do it. I I have to, I gotta pee. I'll be back. I know. I'll be all deconcentrated if I try to read.
25, Green Adventurine. Luck, good fortune, potential possibilities, and new opportunities. And that's why this one right here came out and double. And first, this one, the standing just no matter what, no matter what. Because when you're standing in your truth, no matter what, even if you think the ripple effect is going to be pain, it's actually liberation for other people to really stand in what they need and want and demand for themselves no matter what. So the ripple effect of one person standing in their really true self is what leads to that person's prosperity and the things of like abundance flowing, right? So these the people that we ripple effect and we didn't choose because we did it's not that we didn't choose them. It's just that we're not on the same frequency to be doing the things that they want. But as we're saying no to them, the people who want to say yes to them are going to say yes to them, right? So that's why the double cards are coming out fast today. I know, I, I segued, but hey. Possibilities for experiences your soul craves are everywhere. Offering new opportunities to help you find your purpose. The gate to the field of infinite potential is always open. It really is. For the conscious universe wants you to enjoy the bounty that exists in the realm of possibility and bring it into form through the power of co-creation. Cast fears and regrets aside says Green Adventuring Spirit. You are much loved, and the conscious universe wants to give you all that you desire. The universe is always dreaming up new ways to bring what you need and help you experience well-being, joy, and fulfillment. Beyond what the eye can see lies a field of infinite possibility. The field where the 13th century poet Rumi asked his lover to meet him. Green adventuring spirit calls you to recognize that there is no end to the number of people who will come into your life offering loving support and acceptance. So never settle for less than you deserve. Conscious universe is always sending new opportunities for experiencing love and make sure there is many fish in the sea along with the manner of creatures, starfish, dolphin. You get the point. Open to the new possibility and the love you seek will show up for you. I'm going to catch up to the chat. Glad you're here, Elf for Self. Yeah, Hannah Mari. Be a tree and stand firm. Bend like the oak, though. Right? There's the bend. There's the, the one you... There's the bend and the sway, and there's a shimmy to a tree. There is a shimmy to a tree. There really is. And I didn't mean to say shimmy. I just, <laughs> that's going, but there is. Oh, for self, I am also known as Char, short for Charlene. Well met. Thank you, Charlene. I'm also, my, my first name is Michelle, so I'm Michelle Genevieve. Yeah, number one, eh? I'm glad you're here, Dee. You too, love light shining. Yeah, the seven, D. Yeah, I pull a lot of sevens, eh, Hannah Mori? A lot of sevens. A lot of sevens in the form of uh, five and two. A lot of sevens in the form of five and two, but yeah, I pull a lot of sevens. <laughs> oh, if everybody's going to write the word coffee, then I need a seven. How far behind am I? Oh, just a couple minutes. Hey, Chase. Wish you well too, dude. How's it going? Ooh, Elf for Self. Got me coffee and smokes and sitting in the sun. Yeah, I can't really live stream outside. My Wi-Fi doesn't capped out there. It's 
Stargazer333. Hey, how you doing? Thanks for being here. Thanks for commenting because some people are here and I have, well, I have no clue. Actually, I do, but not, you know, like frequency wise, not in a weird way. Actually, sometimes it's pretty weird. I can't lie. Sometimes it's pretty freaking weird. But that's going off. Where are you, Sun Gazer? 333. Three. I think I might just keep that 333 three, three in there at all times because. We're a do 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 day today. I had to get that in there, eh, Alex? Do 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 do. I might be saying an extra two just for fun. I'm not sure. Do 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 nine. Do 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 nine. Yeah, that. You know what I mean. Oh, for self, from being my true authentic self, sent a wave of energy to open up the abundance flow. Yes. It does. It really does, for sure. <laughs> the light shining says, Stargazer, you call the shots and I take off. Not sure what that means. Because the love light goes shining. Jan Su, yes, sweetie. Oh, Jensu, Janice, I'm so not shocked this card comes up, just in general, um, and even, uh, like, I don't go look at that, but the auroras are shining bright, like, there's got to be people uploading videos or, you know, they're there, whether anybody's seeing them or not, <laughs> I'm not sure, but, um, this is so prevalent that I was actually going to take a picture of it and um take the time because I don't really do a lot of things with my vids and take the time is to put it as the um, if this video uploads to use this for a thumbnail photo that's how much I was already thinking of this card and just the energies it's so prevalent right now the um, you know the message of really starting at one and being firm in self and then that abundance coming through is through uh, and the card just like the colors eh? The, it does is through trusting in the great mystery and that's it like that full circle the double pull, double falling cards with the third as a trinity because it's very important Because a lot of the things that will get people into trouble is, you know, and I'll just say it that way, just speaking 3D really fast, explaining something. But, you know, you stand up for yourself and you go a little hog wild about it. And then you make decisions and choices that it's like so not in alignment that you, you perpetuate another loop of certain things that aren't meant to happen. Because... It, the standing firm in self is with um, complete benevolence. This isn't about like ranting and raving and hurting people standing up for yourself. It's about being in complete surrender to your kind, like your kindest heart and soul and, and making things come into fruition through the, through the gentlest ways and firmest, firmest. Because the ways that people get caught up in everything is the, the babble, the justification. No means no. And you don't have to explain to somebody why you don't want to do a bunch of things or why you're leaving even it somewhere. 
if you decided to go to a restaurant and you want to stand up and leave because the energy sucks balls, do you know you can just go? You don't have to validate it for a half an hour and justify it. You can just say, this feels creepy. I'm out of here. Talk to you later, alligators. And fly. And that's the thing is once you do this part, everything in alignment to your integrity, it doesn't feel that great to be saying like no or to be leaving or to be like, yeah, I really wanted to do this, but while I'm here, uh, this is not cool. I'm out of here. <laughs> But the more you do that, then the more other people will be standing there thinking like, yeah, I came here too and I, I was excited about it, but I'm here and it sucks balls. I don't want to be here either. And they leave. So the ripple effect sometimes when you do certain things gets people thinking. It doesn't, you know, make people think bad things about you. It makes them think for themselves. Am I even happy here, right? Maybe not. Great mystery. Fourteen ten. Great mystery. Have faith and know that you're divinely guided. Even when you have doubts, trust that you're exactly where you need to be. And believe. You've planted your seeds. Now allow the creator to do the rest. Even if you can't see into the future, have faith that the path will be illuminated and go forward. If you have any recurring challenges, turn them over to the Creator. Not my will, but thine will be done. I'm laughing a little bit because of where it says the seed planting and then the, the divine light of illumination type of thing. And I've got my like sweater, my shirt of the seed planting and the divine light and I see the light here and I think those are divine lights for sure because eh? we planted the seed let's harvest them wah, wah. see my tires Alex <laughs> I know I squirreled looking at a card and then my shirt got in the way of Exactly, all for self. A tree never fears the wind because its roots are so deeply grounded. Feeling alive, electrified, chase right on. Okay, love like shining, mother love, bones, song lyrics, stargazer, favorite song. Yes, the Aurora Borealis for sure. Love light shining says Sundays now for three years. You wouldn't believe how the sun looks to me now. Rainbows and diamonds. Chase, I've been a little crazy with the sun gazing. Like I watch it for three hours. I can't say I read a book after, but I feel my body charging. It's very interesting. Yeah. Oh, Elf herself. Thank you. The message I received today was this is a test. This is only a test of the reality check system. Stand by. This is only a test. I get it. <sighs> yeah. <laughs> oh. 
Oh, Jen Sue, that's awesome. Aurora Borealis is something both Adam and I want to see together. You will, sweetie. For sure. Have a good afternoon, Dee. Thanks for being here. You want a black female pug, Jansu? Mm -hmm. Yeah, and the more big tires. I like the big tires. Mm, Jansu says I will, Cindy. It's going to be mine and Hannah Mori's dog together. Okay, love waves drifting forever. Earthlings matter. <laughs> uh, I guess. <laughs> mm. I have so many things I could say about that right now, but I'm not gonna say them. Not in a bad way. Just I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna full circle it. I've been on for 107. <clears throat> Alex says everything matters. Oh, Alex, nothing else matters. So close, no matter how far, nothing else matters. Mm. All right, on Elf herself. Pugs are awesomeness indeed. Mr. Butters is 15 years old. Yeah, I'm not the most tech savvy and I don't have like awesome equipment, so the sound is not very quality like. Someday when I grow big and actually know what I'm doing, I'll probably maybe have a better quality, but right now mm -hmm. it's just me in my living room receiving a text from Kirsten. Whoop whoop. Bringing Phi Harmonics, Phi Harmonics into the live stream. She just popped in. Pugs are awesomeness indeed. I've never had a pug and I've only been with a few pugs ever, but they are oh, cool, very amazing like energy. I think I'm going to be done after unless anybody has anything they want to put up or needs anything else to go through the frequencies of us today. 64, wasp spirit. Sometimes life stings. Not all that wasp that creates, blah, blah. not all that spirit creates in nature is easy to love. But when you look through the eyes of wasp spirit, we recognize that even though sometimes life stings, there's a purpose for pain. Just as there's a purpose for wasps in the natural world. Wasps keep insect populations down, supporting the growth of plants. So too, the sting of life may hurt and you may feel deeply disappointed or even resentful that wasp spirit has shown up. But you will soon come to see that spirit has something wonderful in store for you. You may well come to realize that being stung led to something far better than you had envisioned for yourself. Perhaps behind the scenes, wasp spirit was conspiring with spirit to ensure that you would grow something of value to you. Spirit has a plan and wasp spirit does play the part. Have you ever looked back and been glad your prayers weren't answered because the path you took led to something far better? Wasp spirit is a reminder to reflect on those times. Of course, today's things might hurt. Present tight. But something far better awaits you. Coolio, my jelly beans. I think I'm going to be done. 
really think so. Really, really think so. That's a lot of double cards on the double twos. Go grab a little bit of sun myself. I'm blessed to have it. I can't live stream outside, so I think an hour and a bit. It's gonna be good. Let me go back out. Let me go back out and watch the chipmunks. Oh, what did I? Where's my dudes? Where are you? I found three this morning, but Gary. I gave one to Gary, which Gary chose the one he wanted. Oh, freaking die. Thank you, Chase. Appreciate that. Love you guys. Have a super night, day, afternoon, toes day. <laughs>